It's already the end of February and you only have one week left to do these things. First up, if you want to save XP, I would recommend getting on your bounties ASAP. A good website to check this out is d2recipes.com. I'll leave that down in the pinned comment section below. Next up, we have seasonal challenges and these offer a ton of XP, but more importantly, at this point in the season, you want to try to complete them to claim all the bright dust you possibly can. And in case you don't know, if you complete 72 of these challenges, you unlock Mastery of the Wrath, which gives you 4,000 bright dust. Next up, we have triumphs. First up here, we have the seal for moments of triumph for 2022 you need to do 28 of these in order to unlock it you have until the end of the season and you also have season 19 seal here called seraph you need to do nine out of the ten in order to unlock this as far as other seals go you can guild dredgen deadeye conqueror unbroken and flawless keep in mind it is obviously too late to guild iron lord star baker and also get your reveler seal if you miss the christmas event also if you don't want to miss out on any additional triumphs make sure you do all of them for the corresponding seasons here on these little badges as they will be removed for Season of the Seraph, Plunder, Haunted, and Risen. Also, make sure to stop by the helm if you need any of the craftable weapons from the Crown of Sorrow, Star Chart, War Table, or Exo Frame. All of these vendors allow you to pick up one Deep Sight weapon per day on your character, so if you need any of these for crafting, make sure to get them now before they're gone. If you need help seeing your pattern progress for different craftable weapons, or you just want to see what is craftable, go to your Patterns and Catalysts under your Triumphs tab and just see what you got. If you want to try to craft something, I would recommend trying to do it this week before Lightfall. Lastly, make sure to log into all your characters and go through your Season Pass and make sure you claimed everything, as you wouldn't want to miss out on any Bright Dust, Currency, or Cool Cosmetics. And speaking of currency, as a bonus tip here, I would recommend going in your consumables tab and stocking up everything you possibly can so that way you have everything on you going into Lightfall. I hope this little mini guide was helpful to you. If it was, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Also consider subscribing to the channel and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Stay frosty.